Also new at 10, it's only getting worse. Bluff erosion in Racine County along Lake Michigan is still falling. As Rebecca Clough explains, plans to fix it are now reaching a critical point. Some hard decisions are going to have to be made. You can see the road is already starting to fail and the utilities run right under it. For 30 years, Antonius Van Putten has listened to the lake outside his home. But in the last year, the lake is now threatening to destroy it. This last week, that disappeared with the corner of the street there. The village of Mount Pleasant has known about the problem. There have been public hearings and surveys. A state of emergency was declared by the governor. The village president says the Army Corps of Engineers has looked at a permanent solution, but so far, no money has been set aside. In the meantime, that hasn't stopped Lake Michigan. There's no here. The end of the road is now missing. The utilities are in the road. Jerry Garski says if nothing is done, the utilities will be cut off to the homes at least on Roslyn Avenue, including Van Putten's. Antonia says he doesn't have the money to hold back the lake. The fix is more than $100,000, and his wife has cancer. Breast cancer is now on the bones, and there is nothing they can do more. His hope is that she can be in the home she lived in for three decades in her final days. But that might only happen if the village starts reinforcing the bluffs. So then the village will have to make their decision. The village president says he can't help anymore come Friday. That's because he was voted out of office and a new president will be taking over. Reporting in Mount Pleasant, Rebecca Clough, today's TMJ4. Thank you, Rebecca.